this week we have two big things coming up. One is our eight week checkup, where we'll be doing a weigh in to see how much our birds weigh. And then we will also be doing a processing video because we are going to be able to process some of our larger birds. So I'm super excited about this. This will be our first round of processing this Friday. And then we'll do another round on Sunday, probably. Don't really want to go past nine weeks, so that's my spacing. <laughs> so we'll see how it goes. I might hold out a little bit longer, but not much from Sunday because they turn nine weeks on Tuesday. Hey everyone, welcome to our eight week weigh in and check in. So, the new thing this week is we're going to be processing. Um, they have been eating more foods from our kitchen, like table scraps and stuff like that. Um, we do allow a little salt. I know there are people out there that say don't give them any salt, but we have always done that. And our big egg layers, they're five years old and they're still laying eggs and everything. So must not be too horrible what we're feeding them. So, but primarily we do like greens or any table scraps that were vegetables or fruits and stuff like that. So Kylan has some lettuce that he's going to offer the hen. But first, we are going to do a weigh-in. And just so you know, when she stands up, she's super muddy. Yeah, it's been raining, raining a ton lately. So. Yeah, every I mean, day. Yeah. Which is pretty. great. We need the rain, but yeah. My meat hens are getting really gross looking, but that's okay. <laughs> All right, so we just have a little food scale here. Nothing fancy, and I'm just gonna put her on and we'll weigh her. <clears throat> now they do weigh, move around a lot, so it's kind of hard to get it yeah, accurate. Yeah, it really is. All right, we are at 5.94 pounds. That's heavy, but so, we be. <laughs> when we do process her on Friday, hopefully she will make her six pound mark and be nice and chunky for our processing day. Um, these guys are very big. I mean, they're starting to look more and more like meat. Like you can see under here how thick their legs are. She's like, what are you doing to me? So you can see how thick their legs already are and what those are gonna look like. And then under the wings, you can start seeing and feeling all the extra fat and muscle in there. Hopefully more muscle than fat. <laughs> but yeah, so that is our chicken for eight weeks. Now this is what I'm trying to eat last. <clears throat> they oh. like some lettuce, huh? Yes, they really much do. Do you want it or do you want a new piece? I feel like I can look hot. She's like, no. She wears it as a hat. Yep. Ta da. Ta da. <laughs> or. Uh, chicken salad. Chicken salad. That's our chicken salad. Stretch. <clears throat> oh, there I did we go. it. You got it. Wait, never mind. <laughs> she hates the lettuce. <laughs> All right, I'm super excited. I'm starting to get ready for our processing. As you can see, I'm gonna give you a sneak peek of a little bit of our setup because I haven't finished everything. So we had to clear out an area over here. You wanna be close to water and electricity and don't mix the two, right? So this is our first step. Um, as you can see, I labeled each area so then we know where we're gonna go because I'm gonna have a lot of friends and family over and I want to make sure that we're organized and people can do things without me having to be right there on them all the time I have some food safe buckets down here I just picked them up at Safeway you can get them free in the bakery section and we have two kill cones or hug cones and then over here we have step four so step four will be the ice chest and we will have it full of ice and ice water. And that's just to bring the chicken's temperature down to help preserve the meat flavor. And the rest we will show you come processing day.